I had a comment on um, a couple of videos actually, same comment, asking where the crankshaft position sensor was. And I gave him a reply. Basically, I just typed out what the workshop manual said. But I thought I'd do a better reply and actually make a clip. But um, you can see right here, you've got the crankshaft position sensor. So if I zoom in on that, where you should find it is right here. So there's the oil filter down here. You've got your temperature gauge over there, where you put the oil in over here. Now, the it says to remove the cover to get access to this, but I don't think you can get access to that. Judging by where this is here, um, that would be like kind of center between the cover that comes off over here. If you've taken the covers off, you know what I'm talking about. So the cover over here and the cover over here, this is kind of like in the center. So... I think you probably have to go under the van to get access to this. Now I'll show you another image. So engine mechanical, I think, was the other location. So right here, it's showing you that the crankshaft position sensor is twenty-six. I'll zoom in on that. That's 26 there. Okay. A bit better view. So, so the sensor should be right there. It's where you can't get access to it. You have to get underneath. I'm pretty sure of it. That was another section somewhere. Okay, so here it is, so C crankshaft position sensor under the ignition system. So I'll click on that. That'll take me here. It tells you how to remove it there. This is basically what I replied with straight from the workshop manual. Information, figure nine. And you can see it gives you a clearer picture here of it's there. And you think that's pretty easy to access. But if you know the engine, you know that where you put your oil in, there's not much distance between when with the cover removed to where you put your oil in there. And that's basically doesn't look like that either. The oil thing is further down here, but nonetheless, this is the diagram they give you. So that's all the information the workshop manual has. So I hope that helps. Um, rather than just giving a straight out answer like what I did before of this information here, you can actually get a few images and hopefully that helps the person who's asking the question out and anybody else that's looking for a crankshaft position sensor location. Till next time guys, cheers.